Hello, my name is Brian Frecking. I'm the Southeast District Area Livestock Specialist for OSU. And I'm here to talk to you about body condition scoring. Uh, and we're talking about body condition scoring goats. Uh, it's a system that's used in other species as well. In cattle, we have a scoring system of one to nine. In sheep and goats, it's a scoring system of one to five. And the one being a very thin animal, and a five being a, an, on the verge of being very obese. And so our ultimate goal is to use this scoring system to understand where we are nutritionally with our animals. And we shoot for something between a three to three and a half, uh, kind of almost year round. That's always difficult because uh, uh, growing patterns of our forages uh, can, can make an animal go deficient on, on their energy reserves. And that's really what we're scoring is an animal based on their fat thickness and we're looking to uh, look at that one to five scoring system. Everybody has their own scoring system on their actual hands and we can use our, our, our elbow here or our forearm as being maybe that five on a goat and, and you have to feel the animal to understand whether or not that animal is fat. So if I rub that it feels very smooth to the touch. As I move down my wrist I start feeling the, the wrist area and, and you can start feeling the wrist area and that's where the bones start to come out and so we're at maybe a four and if we rub across the top of our hand then it, it's a feel more of the process of our, our individual knuckles and that's kind of what it feels like on the backbone of those goats or sheep. Go even further on my hand you can see between the fingers we're starting to get down into that thin category. So everybody has their own tools on their own body to, to do a body interest scoring. And so right now I'd like to um, bring out a goat and show you uh, how, how and where we're looking for the, the places to, to score on a goat. All right, on body condition scoring, we actually have to feel the goat. And we're looking to feel the spinal process on the goat from its backbone here. And so we've got uh, uh, the process is sticking up where we feel right across the top. You can't actually see how fat a goat is by just looking at them in the pasture. You actually have to feel them. And we want to feel on the transverse process, or the loin area that they call this. And, and there's a, a, the uh, bones will stick out a little bit on that. And it should be smooth to the touch if they're carrying a lot of cover. If you can feel the very, very uh, deep indentations, then they're going to be thinner. So that's one process we've got to look for. And then we also want to feel right behind this front leg on the ribs to feel that fat cover along the ribs. And she's pretty smooth. The third place we look is right underneath what they call the sternum. And, and you're looking to feel your hands both the width and just feel how, how much fat there is. So we've got three places on a, on a goat that we're feeling for body condition. So one to, one to five scoring system. This goat has, has, has quite a bit of cover. So she's probably almost in that ideal three and a half uh, body condition score. So we actually can break a one to five into halves as well. So this tells us um, how good our nutrition program is. And so when we know that little piece of uh, uh, management tool, when do we actually uh, do body condition scoring? We want to know it basically four times a year. The first one is uh, prior to kidding. We don't want these does to get overly fat where they have dystocia problems. Uh, they can get pregnancy toxemia if they're too fat. And so we don't want them too thin as well. Uh, it's want them in that ideal condition. We also want to look at them when they've kitted, maybe take a score then, uh, prior to breeding, and uh, uh, basically that month before they kid is, is the most critical time period. So those are, the, those are the times of the year we want to actually body condition score, and it's a good tool for producers to utilize.